YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars Diecast Review. Today we're going to take a look at Matteo. Oh Mato's husband and Cruiser Miraz's cousin and Mater's cousin in law from the Cars on the Road episode getting hitched. Before we get right into the review and the retrospective, let's start with the unboxing first. Here we've got his artwork for Cars on the Road, the Cars on the Road logo, the Carburetor County Desert background, new 2023, his name branded Mateo itself, his die cast sealed in, the road trip map background, the Mattel logo, and the Metal logo. And on the back we have the Cars on the Road logo, as seen in, the Metal logo, and all the cars that I unfortunately don't have are Cryptid Buster, Light, Cryptid Busted Lightning McQueen, Griswold, Cryptid Busted Mater, Quadrato Quisar, Jeremy and Nile Speed Cone, 2021 Mattel, Made in Thailand, Mattel Empowering the Next Generation Through Play, Disney slash Pixar, www.disney.com slash cars. And now, without any further ado, Let's dig right into the unboxing. I'll be back after this has been unboxed. Here we have Mateo all opened up and out of the package. I kind of meant to do the lighting on the last clip, but I forgot. But anyhow, Mateo is a Microlux of an unknown model, which the Microlux itself is based is a fictional car company which the models of Microlux is are based off of a Smart 4-2 who, who happens to be the cousin of Cruz Ramirez and later the cousin-in-law of Mater and wife of Mato and was voiced by Oscar Camaco. During his appearance in the Cars on the Road episode, Getting Hitched, at one point prior, Matteo and Mato met and got engaged to be wedded. Matteo anxiously awaited his bride Mato at the altar during his wedding. Unfortunately, he watched in horror as she and her brother Major were battling to prove who was better. This string of competitions caused a wedding of fish and pity, whose name is Justice Stern, who hasn't been released as a diecast by Mattel yet, to leave, regardless of Matteo himself wanting to stay. He then confronted Mato, who was worried that this meant her, their wedding was off, until his cousin Cruz showed up and revealed that she is a licensed wedding officiant during her off-season. Later on, Mateo and Mato were officially married, and after a speech announced by Mater, the two raced to the wedding cake. They even had their honeymoon at the world's largest tire maze, where they got lost. And during his diecast releases, he was released only one time as a single, and hasn't been re-released ever since. And now, without any further ado, let's dig right into the review. So, here we have his... Happy facial expression, his manufacturer logo, which represents as a mustache, 
his circular headlights, no tampos on the hood, the side view mirrors which are white, and a bit of flowers on the left one. And on both sides we've got the dark gray rims on the black wall tires, and his door with a bit of white lining, white trimming, and a bit of white on the front and back fenders and on the footstep. And on the top, there are no tampos, just the in, just his antenna. And on the back, we have his trunk, red taillights, back bumper, the exhaust pipe, and the license plate saying JQ1-2Q1-2 S. And on the undercarriage, it says Disney slash Pixar, Mattel. Made in Thailand. And that is it. Now let's pull up some of the other Ramirez Mater Mater I mean Mater Ramirez family members. We have Mater Cruz Ramirez and his girlfriend, later wife, Mato, who I will record tomorrow. And that is it. So what do you guys think? Which Mater Ramirez family member is your favorite? Mateo, Mater, Cruz Ramirez, or Mato? Let me know what you think, as well as leaving suggestions in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Also, don't forget to check out some of my other videos on my channel. And I hope to see you guys next time for another review tomorrow. So please stay tuned. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye now.